This week is National Painting Week, and if giving your home a makeover is in your spring cleaning plans, you are not alone. A new study says two in three homeowners are planning a painting project this year. TV design star Paige Davis is joining us today to tell us how color can breathe new life into your space. Thanks for joining us. Oh, my pleasure, Kristen. Thanks for having me. So tell us about this new survey. Um, what sort of changes are people making to their homes this year? Color, color, <laughs> color, color, color. Yay, 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 yay. Um, it's so great after hearing homeowners through the years on all these design shows that I do talking about how they just really want neutrals and to keep things boring, if you ask me. It's really neat to find out that people are excited about color and bold color at that. So I've teamed up with Sherwin-Williams to just celebrate, basically, and it's uh, National Painting Week, and it's spring, and people are redoing their homes, they're painting their homes inside and out, and it's just, it's fabulous. How can something as simple as color um, transform someone's home, and what are the, the brightest and, I guess, most popular colors that you're seeing right now? Well, one of the most popular colors right now, believe it or not, is actually more of a neutral. It, it's like a mint green, like a very, very light mint green. And it can be paired with just about every bright color you can imagine, whether it's bright orange or bright red or even a navy could be really cool if you want to be more, you know, traditional. Uh, but really, any color is going to be great in your home. I hesitate to um, give advice in terms of trends with color because it's not like fashion where you can just take it on and off and wear a different piece of clothing sure. every day. Your home is always and it's every day and it needs to rise up to meet you. So I always encourage people to just choose colors that they love. So this week is National Painting Week, which we did not know. So why is now a good time for homeowners to tackle that paint job that they've been putting off? Well, it's spring, and that uh, one is a natural motivator. You know, we've come out of the grays of winter, and now we're seeing flowers blossom, and we're actually seeing color in nature, and it motivates us to do the same. And also, temperate weather is a perfect time to tackle projects. It's much harder to do uh, home improvement projects when it's super cold or super hot. So to be able to even just pull a piece of furniture out to the driveway and sand and prime and paint it is going to be a lot more simple in the spring than in the harsh winter or summer. Okay, so redoing a home can be a very daunting task for a lot of people. For people who want to do something new but they're having trouble getting started, um, what are some tips that you can offer? Well, I always say begin with the end in mind. And one of the greatest tips that I can offer is to create a mood board. Or think of it as a dream board. You know, go ahead and put on a two-dimensional space what you want your room to look like. In a small area like this, you can mix and match paint swatches and different, uh, you know, tiles and all different things before you begin on a larger space. It'll alleviate some of the fear and the stress. And certainly in terms of picking a paint color, you know, don't forget that there's sample cans of paint that you can buy now. So buy the smaller can, test it out on your wall or test it out on a piece of foam core and see how it behaves in the light of your own house instead of trying to figure it out on a little paint chip in the light of the store. Okay, where can we get more information about all of this? Well, nationalpaintingweek.com. It's a, it's a wonderful celebration of everything that's going on this spring. 14 incredible bloggers who are putting up information about their projects and their pitfalls, but also their celebrations. It's a great place for advice and inspiration. Perfect. Paige, thank you so much for joining us today, and uh, happy painting. Thanks a lot, Kristen. Thanks so much. Oh, thank you, too. <laughs>